Cancer has been known as the silent killer. It grows inside a person, often undetected and unseen. Just like cancer, clinical depression often grows undetected and unseen by themselves and by their loved ones. The sufferer blames themselves for their depression and hide it away. Depression can lead to a loss of hope, a loss of talent and a loss of one's job. More people die from suicide caused by depression than from cancer, heart disease, AIDS, birth defects, stroke, pneumonia, influenza and lung disease combined. Sadly, in the next few minutes, another American will kill themselves because of depression. Imagine for a moment the entire population of the United States. That's well over 300 million people. Around the world, there are more than 400 million people that suffer from clinical depression. To find a cure for depression and ultimately prevent it, we need to look at it from an entirely new perspective. Depression is not something you get like a cold. Depression originates from the brain. Imagine we are able to observe the brain directly, peering into the inner circuitry of the brain. Just like there are different types and stages of cancer, there are also different types and levels of short circuits that cause depression. We also see levels of these short circuits in people at risk for depression before the illness becomes full-blown. No two brains are the same. One brain might respond to certain medications and therapies, but another might need a whole new treatment. By precisely identifying the type of short circuit in the brain, we can design customized treatments and preventions to target that specific short circuit. With the help of machine learning and big data, we can create and evolve customized treatments and preventions for every type of brain. This radical shift in how we look at depression, the brain and targets for treatments and prevention can mean healthier lives for everyone. All of this may sound a little science fiction, but at PanLab we are doing just that.